welcome back to my channel guys today i'll show you guys how to make this quick and easy vienna or hot dog cocktail pie recipe if you are new here please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell so you don't miss a single recipe from me all the measurements will be available for you in the description box below so to begin with i'm going to show you guys the puff pastry that i am using and i'm using the puff pastry from woolworths i strongly recommend it and you're just going to allow that to thaw so you're going to take it out of your freezer and just let it sit for about two to three hours until it is fully defrosted then you're just going to roll it out like i am doing right now we're not going to be doing much on the dough because we want to keep all those um, flaky layers as they are so what you're going to do is you're going to place your vienna on the one edge like i am and then you're just going to slowly roll it over and then tuck the seam that you've just rolled over in and then you're going to cut it at that point and then we're going to go ahead and seal it and i'm going to show you guys how to seal it just now this is a very quick and easy way to make um cocktail pies especially if you're hosting or they're also good for lunch boxes for your toddlers so this is what i mean by sealing so you're just going to seal it and that's going to go at the bottom of our pie so i'm just going to go ahead and do it with the rest of the ones that i have left over i used around five of them but you can use more or less depending on um how big or small your viennas are of course and i recommend that you use chicken viennas ch cheese griller you can also go ahead and try and use a russians so i'm just Going to take my baking tin and i'm going to be um spraying a little bit of oil on that just to make sure that the pies don't stick once they're cooking in the oven and then i'm going to head go ahead and cut them into smaller pieces so i'm starting off by removing the excess puff pastry on the edges and then i'm cutting mine into three you can also cut yours into four or however many you want to make depending on the size that you want to make it you can also leave it as long as it is if that's the type of pie that you're going for but i wanted to make mine a little bit mini because i will be using them so i'm just scoring on the top just to make it um look a little bit nicer but it's not a mandatory step so I'm going to go ahead and glaze my puff pastry pies with milk you can also do an egg wash so I'm just doing a milk wash just because I like the fact that I can't taste the uh, milk but if you like egg wash then you can do egg wash yours will just be shining more than mine is so we're gonna pop those into our oven at 200 degrees for 15 to 30 minutes so this is the dishware that i'm using i've got the platter board from pep and also the little ramekin that i'm putting the sauce on i also got that from pep and this is what they're looking like at the end they're really nice and crispy and you can see because we didn't fiddle much with the puff pastry itself it still has those layers and it's nice and flaky i hope you guys enjoyed this video and you're going to give it a try do comment in the comment section don't forget to subscribe if you are new here and i'll see you guys next time bye